I didn't flee and I didn't kick you. So those lights and sirens mean nothing? We're just out Can here. I call my father. No, no. He owns the island. A Florida woman who fled police in her Tesla to allegedly avoid a DUI begs cops to let her father, who, quote, owns the island, come and rescue her. Welcome to After Hours, presented by Law and Crime. I'm Sam Goldberg. Today we're in Duck Key, Florida an island near Key West with a population of under 1,000 people. It was a Monday around 8 p.m. Police were called after 24-year-old Stephanie Bloodworth was spotted allegedly recklessly driving her gray Tesla. Dispatchers were told she nearly hit a palm tree, then put the car in reverse and almost hit two pedestrians. Monroe County deputies eventually tracked down Bloodworth inside her parked Tesla. Turn off of the vehicle. Turn it off. Stand in front of my patrol vehicle right now. Right now. Ma'am! Sorry, what are you accusing me of? Ma'am? Yeah? You need to come over here right now. Why? Because I'm telling you to. You're running from me. I did not. I'm right here. Yeah. Now you are. So, what do you want? Ma'am! Do you need me to pepper spray you? You need to get over here right now. For what? Turn around! For what? 5th Eleven, she's refusing to comply. Get hey! Uh-huh. Get out of the vehicle! You got me up, bro. I own this. Actively island. resistant. Get out of the Get out of the vehicle! She's taking off! <laughs> 5011, I'm in pursuit again. After the officer repeatedly bangs on her window, Bloodworth then drives away. The deputy hops back in his cruiser and takes off after her before she gets stopped a second time. We're stopped again. Sheriff's office. After he stops Bloodworth the second time, she gets out of the Tesla and now appears to be on the phone with her father. Dude, I don't know. The police stop me over. Oh my God, Dad! They're, they're arresting stop me. Resisting. What the hell, dude? What are you doing? Don't resist. What are you doing, dude? You didn't even know me. Dad, they're arresting me. Stop resisting! Dad! Dad! Get on your Dad! They have me on the floor! Dad! Dad! I don't know what I did! What am I doing? Why are you doing this? One detained. Bloodworth repeatedly says she doesn't know why she's being stopped or why she's being detained. No, this is what happens when you flee and then you kick me. I didn't flee and I didn't kick you. So those lights and sirens mean nothing? We're just out Can here. I t- call my father? No, no. He owns the island. 5th 11, you can okay. really see her. Call my father. I'm not calling your dad. Then what are you going to do? Are you? How old are you? I'm 24. Okay, 24, we don't need to call your dad. Yeah, you're right. And you're not going to take me in either. You could have okay. killed someone. Yes, you could Yeah, have. I could have killed you too, but you're alive, right? right you, you, need a, you need to notify him. I don't need to notify anyone. You're an adult. Yeah, because who are you? Uh, he's the police. 
I didn't know that. <laughs> I'm not under the influence, to me. dude. My parents Do you... have three houses here. I... Because Bloodworth was resisting, the deputies determined they couldn't do standard field sobriety tests at that time. Bloodworth's father does eventually show up, and he speaks with his daughter. Dad! 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 Oh. Dad! Stephanie, you have to calm down. Why are they... Copy 7275 You've been drinking, and you were speeding. And, and now the way you've acted, you've gotten yourself in a deep hole, and they're going to take you to jail. You're going to have to calm down. down. Huh? There's nothing I can do. Just, just see why. See why? Calm down. I'll get down there and see you. I can. I'll try to get down there tonight. But you can't. You can't start acting out. It's just going to get worse. What did I do? Well, you bought this. I don't know. Man. What did you, I you know do? What you, you know what you've done. No, I don't. What okay. did I do? Please. So, I'll come do? down there if they'll Why are there so many lights? Why? <laughs> Too bad you didn't see those lights. Because I told you. Over, over, it over, just over. came. You just got here. She got you. She got out of the car. Got back in the car. <laughs> took off. Ran multiple <laughs> stop signs. I am so happy that she didn't kill someone. Yeah. I, it's, it's a blessing in disguise. <laughs> um. <laughs> but even after talking to her dad, she still wanted to be rescued. Oh you didn't gosh. even read me my rights. All right, ma'am. Dad, they didn't read me my rights, and they don't tell me why I'm going in. Ma'am. Ma'am, if you resist, you're going to catch more charges. I'm not resisting. I'm right here. Get in the car, then, right now. Dad! Wait, wait. The officer at the scene asks about any open containers Bloodworth might have had. Debbie, you found an alcoholic beverage in the vehicle? Yeah, I did in, oh. the in the uh, front door pocket. Obviously because of her level of resistance, we can't do exercises. If she's calmed down when she gets there and she wants to do them, and you got enough bodies, that's fine. But we can't risk that with her having fought everybody here already. Yeah. The deputies then took Bloodworth back to the Monroe County Detention Facility in Key West. At times, the deputies' frustration was front and center. I can't, I can't with her, man. I really can't. The deputy did end up having Bloodworth do the field sobriety exercises. She seemed to have a hard time understanding the instructions and even stopped to do some stretches. Once you begin, do not stop until the exercise is completed. Stephanie, do you understand these instructions? You need nine steps, count it. Nine steps, heel a toe, turn around by taking a series of small steps. Do I need to show it to you again? No. You sure Can you I understand? Stretch, though. You need to stretch? Well, okay. I've just been driving all day. All right, Stephanie, you have to, we, we got to start doing this, okay? Right, do you need me to explain the instructions again to you? No. Are you sure that you understand? You need nine steps back. Or... Well, do you need me to go over the instructions again? No. Okay. Can you get into the starting position, please? Do you remember the starting position? Okay, it's going to be the left foot behind, right foot in front, sure. just like this, Stephanie. I'm like the other Okay. Way. <laughs> Are you ready to begin? Do you understand these instructions? Yes. Okay, Stephanie, you may begin. Once inside the police station, Bloodworth seemed at least a little remorseful for the impact this could have had on her family. We'll call your dad and then we gotta go on the road, okay? Thank you, Megan. <laughs> what was that? You said you don't deserve this? My dad doesn't Oh, I agree. <laughs> Let this be a learning experience. <laughs> Deputies took her inside an observation room for 20 minutes, then gave her a breathalyzer test. It took Bloodworth several tries to complete the test correctly, having to redo it over and over. All you can do is take a oh, deep breath. Why? Deep breath. No, but why? I just told you. Because you think I'm wrong. 
and someone has said, I'm requesting you to see if you want to go test your breath with person that's coming to alcohol content. Okay? Yes or no? Would you take the test? Yeah. Take a deep breath. And I'll tell you when to stop blowing, okay? And begin. Blow hard. Nope. No, until that machine starts making noise, you need to blow. You're not blowing it. I am. Understand one thing if you don't. I am blowing You're not. Dude, you can feel my hand. Go. Give me the opportunity that that's, that was no good. We'll go ahead and try again. Go ahead, deep breath. Deep into the cavity. You're not blowing. No, you're not. Nope. Yes, I deep, hard, blow. Oh Until that machine makes noise, you're not blowing. Oh, I'm going to take that refusal. And refusal is another charge. Do you feel my, feel Go my ahead. chest? Go ahead. Like Go ahead. It's not my first day. <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> the machine, you can't fool the machine. So you I'm your, I just don't know if I'm pissing it push, push it all out of your lungs. Are you sucking in or are you blowing? See? You're not blowing. I am. You're not. You're not. Do you think I know how to pull this? I've never done this in my life. Blow me to the tube. I have. Your face can turn red, nothing. Blow me to the tube. Oh no, blow harder. Bloodworth eventually blew a point two six eight. That's more than three times the legal limit. The 24-year-old was charged with resisting an officer, fleeing, reckless driving, and a DUI. She entered a no-contest plea to the charges of DUI and resisting an officer and was sentenced to two years of probation. However, according to court documents, she was granted special permission to travel out of the country in September 2023 for a cruise. For Law & Crime After Hours, I'm Sam Goldberg. I've been living on this island for three years. Why do you do this to me now?